<laughs> Salutations, crustaceans! I am Dr. Lobster, and I am here to reveal the true nature of the bass guitar and see if we can power a bass pickup, an active bass pickup, with potatoes. Let's do this! <laughs> Welcome crustaceans! Today is a very special video. This is a Halloween special where we're gonna do something a little bit silly. You take this home, throw it in a pot, add some <laughs> a potato, baby you got a stew going. So what we're gonna be doing is taking this P base here. Now that P does not stand for precision, it stands for potato because we are going to be trying to power this EMG X, or it's actually a PAX pickup, with these 12 potatoes right here. Now, two potatoes, these are uh, beautiful russet potatoes from uh, good old America. Uh, these potatoes should generate about 1.5 volts together, and six of those pairs should equal the nine volts that we need to power this pickup right here. I don't think anyone's ever tried to do this before, and uh, I think it's gonna sound pretty uh, tubular. See what I did there? Because it's a tuber. <laughs> I cracked myself up. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and see if we can get some sound out of this and maybe how long it'll go. Uh, <laughs> I have no idea the capacity of potatoes, so um, we'll see. Let's get started. You guys know what you need to do. Go ahead and pinch that like button so my hand will turn back to normal. Thanks. So first and foremost, let me just explain what I did here. I have the EMG active pickup in here as well as the EMG pots, and I have the battery uh, connector dangling outside right here as the positive and negative connector. So if I plug in a battery, we should get some signal. Let's test that first. First, confirming. Very faint signal. Now let's go ahead and plug the battery in, see what happens. Oop. <laughs> yeah, this pickup sounds really nice in this bass. Now, I'm only using this pickup temporarily for this particular experiment, but I think it sounds nice in a B-Bass, so great job, EMG. Let's go ahead and unplug the battery now. Confirm. We're barely getting anything. Gonna unplug the base. And let's start building our potato battery. So I purchased three of these little kits off of Amazon. They were like six or seven dollars a piece. I'll link them in the description below. I mean, you can use any generic uh, potato battery kit or fruit battery kit, or you could even, you know, buy the nails yourself at a hardware store. You would need a zinc nail and a copper nail, as well as wires to connect everything together. Uh, but this, made it a little bit easier, so this is what we're going to be using. I have three of these kits to connect all 12 potatoes together and then connect those, this battery over into the, uh, the battery connector here. <laughs> this is gonna be pretty interesting. Let's, uh, let's do this. Guess it comes with a little solar panel too, that's interesting. <laughs> and... Our kit. 
So each potato is going to be getting a zinc and a copper little nail thing. Let's uh, plug them in. And then when you're connecting the potatoes together, you are going to connect a zinc nail to a copper nail. Never connect two nails that are of the same material, otherwise it won't work. Our battery is complete. Let's go ahead and see uh, if this works. I'm just gonna move the battery over here to kind of be in the area of the uh, pickup connector, or the, uh, yeah, the battery connector here. Yep, so we're in the vicinity. Let's plug it in again to show you that there's no funny business. Very low output on one side, no output on the other side. Just like what we experienced earlier. Now let's go ahead and uh, plug this in. We got it! It's a lie! We have a base that is being entirely powered by potatoes! Woo! Oh, I disconnected it. Well, let me let me uh, move this around a little bit so we can get the uh, get this in camera. <laughs> I say it doesn't sound like a potato.
<laughs> so there you have it. We were able to successfully power an EMG PAX pickup with 12 russet potatoes. What else can you say? Like, I, I'm just super stoked that it worked. I, I had no idea this was going to work, and I'm like, oh no, my Halloween special's ruined. But it's not. We got it to work. Woo! Well, there you have it, folks. We were able to successfully power an EMG pickup with potatoes. Let me know what you guys think about this feat in the comments down below. Next time, if you're on a gig and you have active electronics, instead of scrambling around for a 9-volt battery, get yourself a dozen potatoes, have some nails handy, and you'll have no problem. <laughs> Again, a big thank you to EMG for being on board with this project, and let me know what you guys think about this whole thing in the comments down below. And as always, until we groove again.